What do you think this movie is about? There are a great many things that it obviously is about, uh, such as the condition of France during the German occupation, uh, the way it affected relationships between people and even within families, uh, and about the way it uh, broke families up. Uh, we have the Orsini killing his wife because of her treachery. Uh, so it is at that level, it's realistic in its portrayal of uh, a very unusual and, and uh, horrifyingly horrible situation. But because it's a Bresson film, I think it has a great many other layers to it, uh, and that we are talking about uh, the relationship of man and God, which is fairly explicit from the uh, from, from the subtitle, um, but also the way that uh, God is selecting the people who he is going to uh, at least preserve. Uh, and uh, we have the boy, the 19-year-old boy, in the next door cell, uh, who we never see, uh, but we do know that he is under sentence of death and that he is taken out and shot and that uh, uh, he has made no successful efforts to, to escape and, and possibly that is the reason or possibly it is just because he has not been selected. As I say, it, uh, interpretations can be uh, random uh, I don't think Bresson is forcing you in any direction, but I think he he has uh, set up situations which uh, are, as the subtitle says, evidence of the direction in which the wind of God is blowing. And quite obviously Fontaine is predestined to be a survivor.